Hello, girls. Today we're going to continue our lesson with the topic of recognize money part two, and we're going to do this lesson with me, your teacher, and my name is Amira. Before we begin, I need you to be ready. Please set up your study space. Be ready. Prepare your mathematics workbook part two. We're going to continue learning about recognize money. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to recognize color and number in Malaysia notes. Before that, let's do some quick quiz. You're going to look at the question. You're going to do the counting to find the answer. Look at this question. 6 plus 5. You can do count on to get the answer. 6 plus 5. Now, let's check the answer. The answer is 11. Well done if you get the answer correctly. Next question. 3 plus 9. 3 plus 9. Now, let's check the answer. The answer is 12. 12. Well done if you get the answer correctly. Next question. 5 plus 7. 5 plus 7. Number 5 you put at your mouth. Number 7 at your fingers. And do the count on. Now, let's check the answer. The answer is 12. 12. Well done if you get the answer correctly. Next question. 13 plus 8. 13 plus 8. Can you guess what is the answer? I mean, can you count what is the answer? Now, let's check the answer. The answer is 21. 21. Congratulations if you get the answer correctly. Next question. 15 plus 9. 15 plus 9. Do the count on. Now, let's check the answer. The answer is 24. 24. Well done, girls, if you get the answer correct for all the questions. Next, we're going to learn more about money. We're going to look, but that before that, we're going to look at Old Malaysian notes and new Malaysian notes. Let's have the let's have a look at this picture. This is old Malaysian notes of one ringgit. Old Malaysian notes of one ringgit. Next, old Malaysian notes of two ringgit. Old Malaysian notes of two. Ring it. Next, old Malaysian notes of five ringgit. Old Malaysian notes of five ringgit. Now we're going to have a look at new Malaysian notes. This is new Malaysian notes of one ringgit. New Malaysian notes of one ringgit. Next, new Malaysian notes of five ringgit. New Malaysian notes of five ringgit. Next, we have here new Malaysian notes of ten ringgit. Ten ringgit. Next, we have new Malaysian notes of 20 ringgit. New Malaysian notes of 
20 ringgit. Next, new Malaysia notes of 50 ringgit. New Malaysia notes of 50 ringgit. And we have here new Malaysian notes of 100 ringgit. New Malaysian notes of 100 ringgit. Now we're going to look at money characteristic. You're going to look at the picture of the money and we're going to explain the money characteristic. Let's have a look at this picture. Can you tell me what is the color of this? Yes, it is blue in color. It is blue. It has number one. Number one. It has a hibiscus. Hibiscus. Next, it has wow bulan. Wow bulan. And it also has Bang Nagara logo. Bang Nagara logo. Now, we're going to look at the ne next note. Can you tell me what is the color of this note? Yes, it is green in color. It is green. Can you tell me what is the number of the note? Number 5. It has number 5. It also has hibiscus. Hibiscus. For this note, it has hornbills. Hornbills. And it also has Bangnagara logo. Bangnagara logo. So I need you to memorize the characteristic of this note. First, it is green in color. It has number 5, it has hibiscus, it has horn bills, and also it has Bangnagara logo. Horn bills is also called burung enggang in Bahasa Melayu. Horn bills is also called burung enggang in Bahasa Melayu. Next. Can you tell me what is the color of this note? Yes, it is red in color. It is red. Can you tell me what is the number on this note? Yes, it has number 10. Number 10. Next, in this note, it also has hibiscus. Hibiscus. Next. On this note, it has a picture of a flower. This flower is called Raffelsia. Raffelsia. And in this note, it has Bang Nagara logo. It also has Bang Nagara logo. So, I need you to memorize. For these notes, the characteristic are It is red in color. It has number 10. It has hibiscus. A picture of Raffelsia. And also Bang Nagara logo. Well done. Now we're going to continue learning about notes. We're going to tell about the notes value. For this note, which is blue in color, it has number one, 
it has hibiscus and also wow bulan this node is called one ringgit say with me one ringgit it is spelled o n e one ringgit r i n g g i t ringgit one ringgit these notes can also be called as rm1 rm1 but please avoid calling these notes as rm1 ringgit this is the wrong way to state the value of these notes. RM and Ringgit shouldn't be combined in one word or in one sentence. You should choose either one. You need to choose whether you want to write RM1 or one Ringgit. You cannot write both. This is the example of a wrong way for stating the money value. Next, for these notes, which is green in color, it has number 5, hibiscus and hornbills. This note is called 5 ringgit. 5 ringgit. You can spell number 5, F-I-V-E-5, and you write the word ringgit, R-I-N-G-G-I-T, ringgit, 5 ringgit. Or, you can call these notes as RM5, RM5. But, you cannot call these notes as RM5 ringgit. This is the wrong way for stating the note's value. You cannot combine RM and Ringgit in one sentence. It is wrong. You have to choose whether you want to write RM5 or 5 Ringgit. You cannot combine like this. This is wrong. RM5 Ringgit is the wrong way for stating the note's value. Next, for this note, which is red in color, it has number 10, hibiscus and raffelsia flower on it. We can call this note as 10 ringgit. 10 ringgit. Or, we can call this as RM10. RM10. But it cannot be called as RM10 ringgit. RM10 ringgit is the wrong way for stating the value of this note. You cannot write RM10 ringgit at the same time. So that's all for today, girls. For today's Main task, you need to complete page 12, 14, and 16. For page 16, please do activity 1 only. Page 16, please do activity 1 only. Of your mathematics workbook part 2. And please submit this task before 5 p.m. today. For additional tasks, you need to complete page 9 of Mathematics Workbook Part 2. This task can be submitted after 5 p.m. Complete page 9 of Mathematics Workbook Part 2 for your additional tasks. And this task can be submitted after 5 p.m. Reminder. Please refer to your Google Classroom for further instructions. Please refer to your Google Classroom for further instructions. Alright, that's all for today.
thank you and congratulations for your participation in today's lesson i'm going to see you next time goodbye